everybody, this is our week five video for our Valerie and Tommy Leader. Come here, guys. Come here. Um, here with the puppies, everybody's doing great. Valerie's doing great. Um, they are definitely up and moving. Personalities are definitely coming out. Very playful. Um, but uh, they're, they're doing really good. This week, when they're six weeks old, is when we'll go to the vet, get our first... Uh, our first set of shots, um, they'll also get microchip with the AKC microchip. All that information will be, <laughs> come here Miss Yellow, in, uh, in your little puppy packet. Um, you would think I would learn not to wear shoes in here with laces because I can promise you by the time the video is over they will be untied. Yes, and we love to untie shoes. We do, we do. But um, they're, they're at that fun age right now where they are up and moving playing and, and getting into everything and uh, we're getting them used to all different kind of sounds. Um, we have someone that will come in here and even we'll have like vacuum sounds that we'll make and just try to get them used to just everyday sounds and, and things that they're going to encounter throughout their lives. Um, got the ribbons on them. Hopefully you guys can see them. Mr. Blue, Miss Purple's over here. Here's Mr. Brown. Miss White's got a ribbon this time, and then uh, Miss Yellow is over here. Um, also this week, by the time they're six weeks old, we will try to have them completely weaned off Valerie. It's definitely by the time they're just a few days over six weeks. So they are eating the puppy mush now, um, starting to just let it soak a little bit less so that they'll be on solid food by the time they are eight weeks old. But um, anyways, all right, so this we have this video, and then we have one more video next week, and then we will start our picking process. So um, after this time next week is when is when we'll get started on that. All right, so the reason we're all here to see you guys. All right, we'll go with the ladies first. And I'll try to do them. Uh, we'll, we'll go by size. So our biggest girl and our biggest puppy. Uh, she even outweighs all the boys. Yes, she does. Are you stuck? Are you stuck, Mr. Brown? Um, so the biggest puppy is Miss Yellow. This is Miss Yellow. Miss Yellow is our, uh, well, she is, I got my cheat sheet behind me. It's nine, she's nine pounds and two ounces. Um, she is our most active female. She loves attention. First to greet you when you come in. Um, just loves to, to play with her little litter mates. Um, doesn't meet a stranger anytime. You know, we come in, she's right there, first one to meet us. Oh, yeah. So this is Miss Yellow, super thick coat. Ow, Miss Purple. This is Miss Yellow. All right, next, size-wise, um, is going to be Miss White. Miss White is our most laid-back girl. Um, she is eight pounds, eight pounds, six ounces. She's our most laid back girl, um, loves to sleep. Uh, our very, we call her our very lazy puppy. She's, she's sleeping more than she is up and playing for sure. Just laid back. I oh, know. Mr. Blue, ow. Oh, you got my shoes untied. That didn't take long. So laid back girl right here is Miss White. smaller girl which they're all right there together so size really not gonna matter too much um, is Miss Purple. Miss Purple um, loves to sleep on top of the other puppies. They, they're comfortable. Yes they are. Miss Purple is eight pounds and four ounces so we've got nine pounds, um, 8.6 and 8.4 so these girls are all pretty close. They're actually all really close in size. We didn't have any runts or anybody that was small or anything? Where are you going? But um, I think last week we had said Miss Purple was the most laid back. Her personality has really started to come out. She's uh, a little bit more outgoing, and, and Miss White has kind of become more of our, our laid back, lazy girl. So, most active female right now um, seems to be Miss Yellow. In between, we have Miss Purple, and then uh, Miss White is our sleepy, sleepy girl. They all have really pretty coats, real thick coats. There's Miss Purple. 
All right, now the boys, you want to go first? Do you want to go first or do you want to go first? Because you both weigh the exact same. You both weigh the exact same. All right, so our most outgoing boy, oh, tell him, is going to be Mr. Brown. Uh, Mr. Brown is very playful. So I just like to play. I like to have a good, party, good time. I'm the life of the party. Yes, I am. I am. Hmm. Mr. Brown is 8.8 .8 pounds. Really thick coat. Um, their coat color, it's, it's real, for the boys, it's, it's very similar. Um, as far as color, Mr. Brown's coat's a little bit thicker than Mr. Blue's, but um, not a tremendous amount that, that, would, that would make a big difference. So this is Mr. Brown, our active, playful, life of the party puppy. All right. See you guys, you got my shoelaces. That didn't take long. All right, Mr. Blue. Come here, big boy. Come here. This is Mr. Blue. Mr. Blue is definitely more laid back. Um, kind of likes to keep to himself. He's kind of like Miss White is. Uh, when it's time to go to sleep, he'll kind of go off to the side where the other ones will kind of pile up on each other. So, um, seems to be a little bit more independent. Um, really pretty coat as well. Like I said, it's just not as thick as Mr. Brown's. Mr. Brown's got a really thick coat, but you are a beautiful boy. Same weight, 8.8 .8 pounds. So the boys are the exact same size. So this is Mr. Blue. Our laid back boy. Let's see if we can't get y'all. Y'all want to come run? Come on. Maybe they can see y'all play a little bit. Come here, Miss White. Come here. Say, I don't want to. I just want to hang out over here. Uh, but they're all doing really well. Like I said, we'll go to the vet this week. All of that information will be in your puppy packet. Um, I'll let you know what they're eating before they go home. Uh, hopefully you have some idea of what type of training method you're gonna do. I can't stress how important it is to um, start training as soon as you get them. And things that might seem cute at this age, make sure that you think it'll still be cute when they're, you know, 70 pounds. For example, you know, jumping up on you. And it's cute when a little puppy jumps up on you and you pet them. But when they're 70 pounds and they jump on you, it's not as cute. So make sure whatever they're doing behavior that you don't want them to do as an adult, go ahead and correct it as a puppy so that they learn. But um, yeah, these guys, they're doing great, growing fast, getting big. If you guys have any questions about um, any of the puppies, I know we're getting close to the picking process, just shoot me an email or give me a call or a text or or whatever, and I will be more than happy to answer it. Michelle.